Ed. Mr. Rotten. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. What's new? Well, apparently not you lot. Now, mm. what is this? East Village Radio. Well, you... I'm, I'm Mr. Rotten, and I'm here to be interviewed. Enjoy or die. Okay. So me and Max have been doing this radio show for a number of years. Five or six. And, uh, and apparently you've got a good reputation, which is why I'm here. Yep. It's a bit of a shoebox, though, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, like usually it? it's just the two of us, you know, so we got plenty of room to um, exercise, but not today. I'm a little bit horrified by the music you've been playing up to now. <laughs> Do tell, tell me more. It was that one was, uh, two records back? It said uh, Michael Bolton. No, Close. it was Michael McDonald. <laughs> Michael McDonald. <laughs> Isn't he your favorite? We re- Certainly not. Read that on the internet somewhere. Yeah, well, don't believe anything you read on the internet unless you go to Public Image Limited Official. Okay, let's yeah, go there right let's now. Let's go there right now. Tell us more about Public Image Limited. It's a damn fine band. It's probably the best band in the world. Always was, always will be. Uh, we are a creative sort of force to be reckoned with. Uh, we take no prisoners. We play two hours a night, sometimes three, if we can break the fire codes and uh, union officialdoms. Uh, we're consistent. Just about the best thing there is really out there. Play with members also of the pop group and the damned. They, they have their other activities, yes. Yeah. But Bruce and Lou, who are the two you are referring to, I've, I've played the longest in, uh, with Pill in, in any any format. There's been some 39 members of Pill. It's, it's quite a, a, a tasty organisation. It's about the bravery to go forth and make, make new sound, create new energies. Uh, for me, Pill, for my, my part, is that combination of sound and word. Right. I can reach textures and emotions that most other music doesn't seem to have the bottle to want to do. Uh-huh. Uh, my songs are from the heart, they're personal experiences. Sometimes they're other people's personal experiences. Oh, but, but I can relate to pain in others, and uh, I will always champion the downtrodden and the disenfranchised. And so I will never run out of subject matter. Or appear on Pizza Party. Oh, is that supposed to be funny? Sup- supposed to be. Uh, hilarious. Got you there, Kev. Well, I'm so pleased to see the EMI are teetering on the edge. You know, it, I would love to congratulate myself to think I was part and parcel of that. You know, but I, I, I like to see their eminent demise because they are corrupt and, and they've done nothing for music. The people they've backed and supported, and then Virgin Records are a part of that too, have always been awful. The money they've spent, the money, you know, the, the money they have spent on, on, on the lousy acts, it, it has been quite disgusting. You know, signing up the likes of Janet Jackson for 80 million. I mean, what a load of fucking bollocks. Really is. You know, and you know that's pat cack and fat nonsense. And, and any bands really out there, you know, that like, are striving to create something new. They seem to, like, well, disrespect entirely. And Public Image is, is one of those bands that both those labels are fucked over. Atlantic 2, you know, all of them. Dogs, dogs. But they don't mind signing up the imitations of the music I've been creating, you know. They'll back them to the hill. And that's the great tragedy of it. And that's why, I suppose, now in our modern urban society as we know it, we get arseholes like Green Day calling themselves punk. You know, it's an absolute fucking offence, isn't it? You going to see American Idiot on Broadway? <laughs> Aptly named, really. Yeah, tell me Aptly about it. Aptly named. And on Broadway, I mean, that's a fiasco. I always thought they were coat hangers, but that proves it. Have you ever thought of... No, it does, doesn't it? You know, I mean, you know, what, 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 what's enjoyable about that? Theatre prices, sit in your seat and watch a live performance. It, you, you get up and move, you can't. They, they've killed any energy at all. Any, anything they ever had going for them, they've just about now murdered, you know? They're like a third-rate Las Vegas parody. I had uh, heard stories about them... Uh them on tour recently at this moment. Where's where... my beer? Oh, yeah. <laughs>